The San Francisco Police Department's budget was close to $703 million. A new report from the Center on Juvenile and Criminal Justice is taking aim at the service being provided by San Francisco police. Given all of that tax money being spent, police officials say they consider the report to be politically motivated. Cronfors Hazik Madun has the story. San Franciscans spend more and get less from their police department than most major California cities. That is, according to research data in a six-page policy brief released this week from the Center on Juvenile and Criminal Justice. This is pretty bad, and it's also getting worse. We have seen declines in arrests and in crime clearance in San Francisco over time that are pretty alarming and which have not occurred uh, to the same extent elsewhere. The Center on Juvenile and Criminal Justice graphic shows the percentages for the SF police budget per resident, police employees per resident, and reported crimes per resident are all going up, while arrest and crime solved are trending in the other direction. When you read that, your thoughts? I mean, nothing that, that folks like me don't know, and, and what we've been trying to assert and really is the basis for the defund movement, right? That we continue to invest in the violence of policing in the cross rural state, but there's there's little to no definitive data that more cops equal less crime. And and um, and and actually, if if you look at the the communities with the most police, right, which are mostly urban areas, that's where crime abounds, right? So we're investing in the wrong things. I, I think this is a political. Um, hit piece that is masquerading as scholarship. SFPD Director of Communications Matt Dorsey says the decrease in arrest statistics are more of an indicator of national trends that are not unique to SFPD. It's, it's interesting that this organization is criticizing us because this is an organization that actually advocates for fewer arrests and they're criticizing the police department for making fewer arrests but actually that, that reflects a national trend rather than um, you know, something that's, uh, we're, we're not delivering value for the policing that the San Francisco Police Department's doing. Officials at SFPD point out that the department's homicide clearance rate is above average in the state of California. That's good. Uh, they should be proud of that. But they have very low rates of arrest for the other major violent offenses, rape, robbery, and aggravated assault. The Center on Juvenile and Criminal Justice Policy Brief's recommendations include an independent agency collecting crime statistics and that the city look at alternatives to policing for crime prevention. Hazik Medyun, Cron 4 News.